Hello, this is KB3FXI. Name is Dave, and I'm going to do a very short uh, video on training for the basic NBMS FL Digi setup for use with the MT63 digital mode on VHF, UHF, FM. Uh, the first thing you want to do is go to the www.w1hkj.com website for the NBMS software and download the latest versions of FL Digi and FL MSG. Uh, once you do that, uh, the installation process will walk you through a setup wizard, which is self-explanatory, so we'll kind of skip that step. But once the software is installed, you want to open it up. The first step you want to do for the configure is go to the configure, go down to miscellaneous, and then select the text capture tab and what you want to do is make sure that the enable detection and extraction is checkmarked. This is an optional checkmark <clears throat> that will bring up uh, the received uh, folder uh, that the uh, received files are, are stored in automatically and I do have that selected in mind so then what you want to do is click save and close. Then our primary mode is MT63 for use on FM and we use the 2K long mode. But what you want to do is go to configure, down to modems, select the MT63 tab and make absolute sure that the 64-bit long interleave is checkmarked and the 8-bit extended characters is checkmarked and then click save and close. <clears throat> now for operations uh, all we need to do is go to operation mode. We're going to arrow down over MT63 and then arrow over and click on MT63 2000. And that puts us in the proper mode. Now prior to your first use of, of MT63 with the NBMS software, you want to do the calibration setup. You can go to my call sign under qrz.com look up my call sign there's links for additional instructional videos and a website for setup information on the calibration routine. Okay now I'm gonna uh, go ahead and uh, go to my uh, netbook computer that's sitting just nearby the microphone I'm speaking into and that we have uh, the FL Digi software set up for and I'm gonna go ahead and do a test uh, transmission right now. our indication of the file extractor. And we have the indication that the file was saved and the pop-up window for the uh, folder automatically shows here and that's our newest file. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and close this and I'm going to open this up in the FLMSG form and you just go to file, wrap, import, select the most recent file, click open and there's my formatted ICS 213 form. Now one other additional uh, setup is uh, under configure, sound card and you just want to make sure that you have the proper uh, receive and playback settings for the sound card that you're using and if you have multiple sound devices they'll be listed in this box. So that's pretty much it. Uh, you can see that it's a pretty minimal setup procedure. Uh, the software is extremely easy to use. Uh, it's available for use on Linux, Mac, and Windows. So uh, it's cross-platform and just about anybody can use this. And all that's necessary is just a, a simple inexpensive plug-in microphone to plug into your sound card or even if the computer has a built-in microphone uh, that'll work sufficiently too as long as you're just close enough to the uh, radio speaker to detect the uh, MT63 mode. If you have any questions feel free to drop me an email at kb3fxi at yahoo.com. Thanks and 73.